Welcome back everybody to Farming Simulator 19 here on Long Oak Farm. Folks, how y'all been doing? Y'all been doing all right? That's awesome. It's your host with the most, well sometimes, Mr. Blue aka Tommy Miller. Folks, we are in the cat. Uh, it's kind of like the big M but this skin of the cat. And I know this is unrealistic but... It gets the job done. Yeah, let's just uh, stop for a second here. Let's turn the mower off and we'll leave the engine running. It's the Caterpillar. Um, let me get back in so y'all can see what it is. Pack M500. Um, I think Nick the Hick done a uh, review on this. So you can go over to his channel. Just type in Nick the Hick. And who we have here? Uh, driving the 9570 RT. Uh, Helper Andy. Okie dokie. So my names ain't working again. That'll be alright. But this is part of the, the pack too. It's Caterpillar. I'm in a fly mode looks like. Yep. Go up this a little bit. Well, you can see it's dirty. I've been doing a lot of mowing and a lot of changes, folks. This is going to be a little short episode. I'm going to try to get my uh, audience attention span where I need to be. Um, I don't know if it's accurate. I, I really don't know that much about YouTube. Uh tools and stuff I, I just I just don't know folks but anyway anyway it's shown I'm only getting like two and a half to four minutes of average watch time per video and I was watching Mr. Yankees getting a black line through screen there I don't know if it show up on the recording or not but if I turn this away see you might can see it every once in a while. But anyway, uh, I was watching Mr. Yankees, uh, Yankees Outdoor Adventures. Uh, he's doing a thing all this month in February to help creators and stuff. I need to go over and catch his live stream. I really do. But he's talking about make shorter videos. You know, if your time's only showing the average of four minutes, that if you make a 30 minute video, that's 26 minutes wasted. So, I'm going to try to keep this probably about 10 to 15 minutes and do a few of them that way uh, to see if I, you know, get my watch time up there per video to 100%. And then I'll start making long ones again. But, yeah, this episode is going to be about this mower and the pickup deal behind us, wind roller pickup. Um... And the changes that's happened since I put out, I think, like four videos. And everybody's like, welcome, be back. And I'm thanking all of y'all. You know, I'm glad to be back. But those were old videos back in January that I recorded. Like January the 1st and, and the 6th. And I think one was on the 15th. So this is third, uh, no, excuse me, Tuesday, February the 11th when I'm recording this. And I'm hoping to get this out today of the day I'm recording, which is, you know, February 11th. It's 9.20 right now, a.m. And this should come out at 4 p.m. So, I just want to give a big thank you to all of you that's been supporting me, either through watch time or, or you know, funds or whatever. And speaking of funds, I do have a PayPal account, in case some of y'all are curious. Uh, links down below in the description. I also have some other links down in there, too, so be sure and check them out. I'm going to have to let him catch up, because he's on follow me. So this will be a good time to actually show y'all around. Um, y'all will remember... Um, Y'all probably remember 
this being canola and these two fields over here being wheat well i haven't got that for yet i'm in late summer on this and see i had to restart the map i'm like i love this map i want to actually play on it well my animals got where i had cows and pigs but no chickens or sheep so we redone some of this we got all new different equipment and yeah it's this let's just say i got my chickens and sheep i got all the animals now so that all that's good let's go in here real quick so y'all shit look trying to talk too fast i now have 300 pigs folks but that's not what i started out with these suckers have tuck off and, and they're growing like weeds uh, i'm opening up my little thing notepad on my tablet here i started out with 100 pigs 100 okay and it went to 137 154 and then i lost count after that it just you can see i'm at 300 now and that's their food and stuff i have not put no straw so it's all slurry from them the chickens here by my house uh they're at 200 and let's see that's what i originally bought so ain't none of them grown none so i'm thinking i'm gonna have to add some to that to make them grow uh cows they're still a hundred but uh, if you go through here you can see it won't be too much longer i'll have a few more cows so that's good but they're doing good. I haven't gave them any straw yet for manure, but I'm going to change that pretty soon. Our long oak sheeps was 150. That's what I started with. Um, I don't know if any of these sheeps will reproduce. I don't. Th I think I just got the ones for wool, so we might buy some more sheeps too. Uh, now, this is an open sheep pasture. I got eight. And here, I forgot to add them to this pasture. So we're going to probably do that here in a minute. Uh, eight on this and eight on this. And I had four total. Free range chickens, 30. And 30. And that's all over by the sheep, south of the sheep. No horses yet. That's where we're looking at on that. Um, I might do some of this off screen. I don't know. But I want to... My beans and stuff be ready to harvest here pretty soon, which that might be off screen too. It's going to auto save, but anyway, I'm trying to get as much in as I can. And you can see right here, 30, 31, 32, uh, corn here, sunflowers, uh, all these are ready to be plant right here. And you notice we'll own more fields too, because I got 28 uh 10 and 11 let me switch this over to here so you can see 45 42 is beans uh 35 34 29 is all grass uh 46 20 21 22 23 in this area is, is grass uh corn sunflowers uh this is going to be in the last episode that y'all saw this was layout ground so see it's going to be a little confusing if you don't listen oh well, that didn't sound right did it i know y'all listening but anyway i'm not to where i left off on the last video so i'm going to harvest these two and they'll be laid out for layout ground for the next crop for next season and this will be wheat and this will be canola and that's probably going to be canola and uh, that's what I just got done. I had wheat here and wheat here and canola here. And I already harvest them. So uh, in the future, this is going to be canola, canola, and these three going to be wheat. Because we're going to have a lot of chickens we're going to have to keep up with. Um, yeah, and as we progress with this right here, let me go over here and show y'all real quick. All right, here's your sheeps. <coughs> Excuse me. Um, yeah, there's the barn. 
we're south of the sheeps, the main sheep farm. Um, but yeah, ah, you too. I'm just going to let them produce their own wool pallets, but you know, we got, I got a water tire. Actually, let me just go up in the air. Got a water tire here, but really don't need it because I, I wasn't thinking that these were going to have the water thing, but we can just pretend that water tire is feeding these water drums, right? And I put a fence all the way down, and now I got to cut out some more trees right over there. I'm going to take it to the house and take uh, put a gate in there and just keep all the animals in. This is a wool storage point. Uh, so we can put all wool pallets in. Here's our chickens. They're doing pretty good. Once again, they got the, their own water. And we got bags of feed for them for right now. Uh, we do have wheat. I just got to get some trailers. My gravity flow wagons. I don't have them on here yet. Um, and you see I got a fuel tanker now and a fuel tank put in here. So when we fill up our tractors and stuff over here. Probably going to put a little shop or something here to store the tractors in. Nothing fancy, but... Um, last video, you'll probably seen all this cut down through here. And yeah, I just... I went in a different route, folks. Every which way. I got a bunch of other buildings and stuff in. Well, I can't show them all this time. Um, like I said, I'm going to try to keep this video short and packed with a lot of talking for and this and the next one. As you can see, we got sheeps down through here. And uh, yeah, and like I said, uh, and there's my header. Got to get a trailer for it. Um, got a grass dryer put in. You dump the grass in the backside there. It dries it. Yeah. Oh, that stupid train. You unload it here, and then I got a storage point right here where you can put, I think, straw, hay, grass, silage, all kind of stuff in this, but we're just going to put hay in it. And that's so we can mow the grass anytime, put it in a dryer, which I know it's going to cost money doing that, but and once it gets dried, we can put it over in this for our sheep. And there's another storage point, as you can see the wool in here. That's what these made since I started the game. 13,000 liters of wool so far. Now that's awesome. That is awesome. Now that's going to cover the sheeps here. What else do I got? Uh, let me fly, fly over here. And you can kind of see where our grass field starts right there. And we're going to go on over here real quick. There's the pigs. Oh, I'm getting lag. But all the trees right along in here, I cut out all the way down to here. We got the bulldozers down here getting rid of a few oddball ones that's hard to cut. Uh... Yeah, I bought this field here, and I don't know if I own that in here or not. Let's see here real quick. No, I did not buy 47 yet. It's just 10 and 11. So this field and that and it's been worked up right there, all the way back to our shop. So we're probably going to have another small chicken area here since it's a little pen there for it. But I'm just going to cut the trees that's on this side of the highway, and through here. I think about putting some more cows. Oh, my phone. Um, only thing I own over here is this field right here. 27. That's where I could put this down. This is a pig food mixer. And this is uh, to store crops. So we can put our crops in here. And as we need them, we can pull them out and put them in the mixer. And feed our cows. I mean, bleh, sorry feed or sheep and uh yeah so i think that might wrap us up i don't know but they all have their own little water system so we don't have to worry about trucking water and stuff at least so far we don't got these little buckets we can use to clean up 
They're pretty neat, folks. They are pretty neat. Uh, I think that's going to cover it. I'm going to go in here and save it again. Oh, goodness gracious. Um, been doing the contract missions and stuff. Uh, let's see. No loan. The trees have paid for pretty much everything. Um, I'm not watching this yet, but it, none of this is going to show up right because we don't have none in the original sell point. It's just mostly in another silo we got built. But I'm going to show that here in a minute. Uh, I got to get back mowing. Because tomorrow I'm going to plant uh, wheat and these three fields here. And then when this gets ready to harvest, which is getting probably tomorrow be ready to harvest probably. But anyway, uh, what was I going to see? I showed y'all these. And I showed you these. Uh, showed you the pigs. Uh, let's go right here and visit. This is the farm shallow. And that, oh, oh, I didn't want to do them. I'm trying to trying to fly, I guess, and hitting the wrong butt. There's our baler, uh, tether, and wrapper. You're going to see a bunch, a bunch of new equipment. Uh, we'll get in that next episode, like I said. I cut all the trees down around here, and I put up these trees so the cows can have shade. And um, I'm trying to get it back as much as I had it, but there will be some differences. This is a TMR station. Got solar panels in to run all the electric here on the farm. One, two, three, four of these. Um, right now, this is the planters I'm using, which y'all probably see them in tomorrow's episode. I'm not for sure. Um, uh, like I said, I got some equipment and some equipment I don't have yet. So that 467,000, uh, which is eaten away because the tractor's running. Uh, I'm not going to show you that kind of mine because, uh, we're not going to start that big. I just use it for tip. I'll show it to you. Uh, is this a John Deere model? It's a CR2090 or what is that? 1090? Go down so I can see. The CR1090. Uh, New Holland. It's this wrapped with a John Deere skin. I do love this, but it's unrealistic. So that's why I'm not going to be using it. And one last thing, I guess I'll go ahead and show you the silo over here. Um, this is what I got so far. You got 173,000 wheat. Oats, I done a mission or contract to get them. Got 13,929 out of that. And 172,000 liters of canola. Total mixed rations. I've been storing some in here, but... We can store, I also got straw in here, but it don't have straw on here. But it's got grass and wood chips, chaff, forage, total mixed rations. I'm like, it's got to hold straw. So I put straw in there and it held it. So that's good. Uh, go back in fly mode here real quick. Uh, this here is a... Uh, fragmenting silo. You put grass in there and it turns it to silage. So that is for our TMR mixer, which once it gets full, I'll put it in here for storage. And it also makes digestate, so it's going to help us on our fields. So yeah. That is pretty much going to wrap up everything, folks. Uh, I'm going to get into the equipment in the next episode, which we got new new equipment um new equipment to come as you can see right there at red one's a new uh herbicide trailer so yeah uh solar panel here for my house totally separate from the barns yeah i'm in 19 minutes i said i was going to do 10 to 15 so i'm gonna get off here folks i hope y'all enjoy this i'm sorry it wasn't too much uh actual work in it but i'm just trying to get y'all up to date i'm trying to get the game back where we were before 
the mishap happened. And I will tell y'all about that in the next episode. Till later, I hope all y'all done well. I appreciate y'all's support and love. Folks, y'all have a great day, a blessed day. And that we'll see you in the next episode of Mr. Blue Farms, a.k.a. Tommy Miller. Later, folks.